Good morning. Good morning, baby. It's bright, huh? Oh, look at the face. Look at the face. I love you. Can you change your diaper? Are you hungry? Come on. Let's go. Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another vlog. I'm doing a little day in life today. I'm exhausted despite how energetic I might seem right now. I'm feeding Rocco really quick while Zeke is still in bed, but. It's just newborns or how long this lasts but their hands smell so bad <laughs> it's like the built-up amount of like milk and sweat and lint because he keeps his hands like this all day like in his clothes and then when he finally opens them i love you so much but your hands they stink they do they just really stink <laughs> Good morning guys. I wanted to say a quick thank you to Cozy Earth for sponsoring today's video. If you don't know, Cozy Earth is a premium bedding and loungewear company. The PJ set I'm wearing right now is actually from them and I slept in it last night and it was amazing. Literally a dream. If you know, you know the postpartum sweats <laughs> at night are real and this really just helped to regulate me and like I wasn't sweaty last night because the material in this is so nice so cooling and i'm just obsessed with it all of their products are made from super soft viscose from highly sustainable bamboo so you know you're getting the best quality stuff they have two newest pajama set colors one of them is this powder blue color and they also have a lilac that are so pretty and so perfect for spring you guys i really want to pick up the lilac one because this one is just my new favorite pj set i also have this white set it's the exact same but just in a different color so the packaging looks like super super nice like i said so cozy nothing better than a white pj set am i right and here is the top to this one so amazing you guys i'm so excited to sleep in this set tonight you can actually use my code lauren35 to get 35 percent off your purchase which is an amazing deal if you use the link in my description box below then the code will automatically be applied to your order so yeah thank you cozy earth for sponsoring today's video love you guys and let's get back into it okay well zeke is just chilling in his dock tot i'm gonna quickly try to get ready i just slicked back my hair into a bun but I, and wash my face but i'm gonna go brush my teeth do my skincare and then change and get ready for the day hopefully he stays content in here but if not we're gonna have to grab him but you know that's okay Okay, skincare is done. Zeke is getting fussy. So I need to change really quickly and then we need to grab him. So let's go pick an outfit really quick. Okay, this is the little fit for the day. This crew neck is from Amazon. I wore them like my entire pregnancy and I love them. And then these pants are from Target, I think. They're just like basic pants and yeah. Hello, are you ready to go downstairs? You're so sweet. No pizza in here. I'm looking at the window. Where's your scrunch? Where was your scrunch, huh? Say good morning, guys. Good morning, family. I think the hardest part about doing this by myself is having to bring everything up and down stairs multiple times a day. I only have two hands, and one of them is fully dedicated to carrying a baby, so. <laughs> you need this. You need my water, my camera, and my phone. Let's go. 
crazy boy. You are a crazy boy. Ready to be strapped? You want to be strapped? Okay. Throw up on our clean clothes, huh? That's how we're going to start. That's how we're going to start the day. All right. Now we can get things done. This is my first morning actually where I have not had anyone come over. Um, usually, if Keiko is not home, if Keiko is working, my sister Brittany will actually come over and hang out. Or my mom has been here too. But today, we don't have any visitors in the morning, so that means a few things. One is that I don't get to take a shower this morning, or probably today at all. And two, we've got a long day ahead of us with just us two. Which is totally fine. I don't want to get too used to having people over because obviously it's not going to be like that forever. Um, so yeah, today is Wednesday the 22nd and Keiko gets back from work tomorrow. So he was gone yesterday and he's gone today and he comes back. He comes home tomorrow, which we're very excited about always. My friend Daniela is actually coming over today. She doesn't live in California anymore, but she's coming to visit because she's going to be in San Diego for the night. So she's coming over and she's going to meet Zeke for the first time, which is so exciting. And I can't wait to see her because it's been a long time since I've seen her and also I haven't even talked to her that much recently. We're excited for that, but they're not coming over until like 5 p.m. or something. So we really really have all day. I think I'm gonna make some breakfast. I'm either gonna make breakfast or I'm gonna eat the leftover Chick-fil-A I had from yesterday because first of all, don't want, to, don't want that to go bad. Second of all, it sounds really good to me right now, even though it's 10 a.m. So I think we're just gonna eat some Chick-fil-A. But it's also barely anything, so I'm probably still gonna be hungry after. So then we might have to make something. This is the carrier that we've been using. Besides the Sully Baby wraps, um, the only like structure carrier that we've used so far since he's still really little is this Ergo Baby. I think it's the Embrace carrier, but you're able to carry newborns in here. And the, a lot of other carriers um, are only suitable for like bigger babies, but we like this one, especially when I need my hands around the house. I also kind of want to make some coffee, but it's going to have to be decaf because I'm still on the anxious train a little bit. So we're not trying to get more anxious by drinking more caffeine. Because I made one yesterday and it was super good. So I'm going to eat this Chick-fil-A really quick and then we're going to make some coffee. He literally just chills in here. He's probably going to fall asleep soon because he was really tired upstairs. And also whenever he's strapped to me, he always falls asleep. So I'm also going to eat a couple of these Aussie Bites. My sister brought them for me yesterday. Oh, by the way, Costco. And they're just so good. They're just like little oat cluster bites with like a bunch of stuff in them. And they're delicious. Okay, baby is sleeping, coffee's made, and we're gonna chill for a little bit. Okay, while he's still asleep in this thing, I'm gonna take advantage and do, whoa, I almost just tripped some things upstairs and just clean up a little bit. It's not too messy up here, but I just wanna make the bed and like clean up his nursery a tiny bit because there's just kind of stuff everywhere, as always. <laughs> also, we had to roll up this rug because it was just so annoying because it would get so bunched up and literally nothing worked to keep it in place because we laid it on carpet. If it was on hardwood, it would be a completely different story, but putting a rug on top of carpet just did not work for us. And I wish it did because I liked the look that it gave of like the lighter floor, but just was not practical and it was really frustrating every time it would bunch up. So I just rolled it up and we're gonna take it out. So yeah. Okay, he just has some clothes right here that I need to fold and put in his drawer and then he should be good. His Easter basket is filling up with stuff. So that's exciting. I showed him my last vlog, I think like all the little things I got so far. So if you wanna go see that, go watch that vlog, but I just can't believe how much he's growing already and I know everyone says this about their baby But like he literally grows so fast. I don't know how much he weighs because we haven't had an appointment since he was like a week old But all I know is that he's definitely bigger. He's so much longer. He's so much heavier So he's gained a lot of weight too, which is obviously all good things 
which means he's just feeding really well so that's good and that's all i could ever ask for is that reassurance and i know that i have that because we can physically see him getting bigger but yeah it's just so surreal and they say you only have a newborn for like seven or eight weeks i don't know which one it is seven or eight but he's literally almost five weeks he'll be five weeks on friday and today's wednesday so i'm already not okay with that like yes I cannot wait for him to grow up. I mean, I can wait for him to grow up, grow up, but like when they're like a few months old and they have their social smiles and their laughs and you can like actually like play with them. Like that's exciting, but also I'm gonna miss this stage so much. And I'm gonna stop talking about this because I'm literally gonna start crying because I'm just so emotional about this all the time and just how much he's already grown. We kind of went on our like first family outing last sunday besides like going to the store and stuff um we went to my dad's house and all my family was over there and we had like a little birthday party but everyone's like he's so much bigger already and i'm like yeah i know like it's not just me that's noticing he's actually so much bigger yeah all good things but it just happens so fast like everyone says and like i feel like i'm doing a good job at like treasuring every little moment that i have with him because i know that it's gonna go by so fast and i already feel it like going by so fast but at the same time like you can never like no one's ever ready for their baby to get bigger so so yeah that's my little chat because i just can't believe it my little six pound four ounce baby is probably almost i feel like he's definitely over eight pounds now he also fits in his kite baby newborn now when he first came home from the hospital he was literally swimming in them like he was so small you guys he had the skinniest little tiniest legs and arms and ankles and now he's getting little rolls and it's just the cutest thing ever but also makes me so sad these are kikos i don't know why they're in here i also need to restock diaper caddies like both of them because they're both like basically out of diapers so we need to do that everyone says this you literally go through so many diapers I think especially with a boy because of the fact that they like to pee when you change their diaper and then it gets on the new diaper. I feel like we go through like two diapers at a time. <laughs> a lot, but it's true. So when people tell you you go by go through diapers really fast in the newborn stage, they're not kidding. We're literally almost out of newborn and we just bought a box, so that's cool. Okay, the bed is made, the dresser's kind of cleared off, threw all the diapers away that were on the bed, and then packed a couple Poshmark orders that I still need to like put the shipping labels on. And nursery's not cleaned up, but I did a little bit. So we're gonna head downstairs now because my back kind of hurts, so I kind of want to take them off and lay them down. But I'm bringing diapers down there so we can restock the diaper caddy. Okay, we are back downstairs now. I took Zeke out of the carrier, but he woke up, so. I'm gonna feed him right now. I'm also gonna watch, um, if you follow Gabrielle and Dylan, they were pregnant with twins and they had their twins at like 26 weeks. And I've just been following along on their journey for so long. And they just posted their birth story, so I really wanna watch it. So I'm gonna watch that while I feed Zeke. They have like an amazing story though. Their girls were in the NICU for like five months or four, almost five months, and they just got to go home very recently. And their story has just been amazing in the ways that God has healed and the miracles that he's performed for their baby girls. And yeah, so I'm gonna watch this and relax for a little bit. <laughs> Okay, I just put Zeke down in a swing. I don't think he's gonna stay in there long, but we're gonna try to make it last as long as possible because I wanna eat lunch. I'm very hungry, so I just heated up some fried rice that Keiko meal prepped for me before he left for work. So we have that. It's just shrimp fried rice. This looks huge, but kind of is, but I'm very hungry. Girls gotta eat. He's finally dozing off again, so hopefully he stays. He doesn't stay in his swing too often. Maybe if we start using it more, then he'll start liking it more. He doesn't hate it, he just doesn't like staying in there too much. But I also have kombucha. It's the pink lady apple one. And I'm gonna scarf this down because I'm hungry. I also have been binging New Amsterdam. If you watch it, you know how good of a show it is. Um, I'm obsessed with it and I just started season two. It is so good. So I'm gonna watch some of that. And this is how my days typically go when I'm by myself, so. Won the cancer lottery. Yeah. Nice. Okay, it's 12.30. I'm still watching New Amsterdam. Zeke is still sleeping. He's like kind of asleep, but kind of not. 
He's just making a bunch of noises, but I'm gonna get a piece of this chocolate bread that I made the other day. There's like a local coffee shop that has like these baking mixes and every single thing I've made from them has been so good, but this literally just tastes like chocolate cake. So delicious. So I'm gonna get a piece of this. Not much to update you on. This is how my days go, especially because I don't leave the house yet or I haven't left the house yet with Zeke by myself and it's also supposed to be raining today so we're taking it real slow but it's good because then i have time to recharge for when keiko gets home so then we can go do things as a family and get out of the house but you're welcome for showing me this and you're welcome for making you want some chocolate cake okay just got a couple packages so i'm gonna open them because i'm excited to see what's in them i placed like a really big amazon order a couple days ago and things are just starting to trickle in. So, someone is also awake now, so that's great. We've got some mouthwash, because I've been wanting to get some, and saw this on Emily Kaiser's TikTok, and I got it on her Amazon storefront. Also got some more leave-in conditioner, because this, I actually haven't tried this one. BRB. <laughs> Okay, I'm back. I've never tried this, but I've heard so many amazing things about it. It's the, it's a 10 um, leave-in product. I decided to use this. And then that's it from Amazon so far, but there's a lot of other things coming eventually. So we just have to wait for those. Look at his face. I love your lips. You just want to be held. Okay. I think this is from Skims. I've been waiting on this package for so long. And it finally came. Wait. Clock shirt, maybe. Okay, so I think they accidentally sent or purposely sent two extra things that I did not order. That's exciting. I'll show you those in a second. These are what I did order. These are the ribbed long sleeve t-shirts. Like the soft ribbed or like fits everybody. Oh yeah. I've been so excited for these. I got two just regular long sleeve tops. This one's in marble. I got them both in a size small. So I got this one. And then I also got it in this heather gray color. And I'm excited about these because they're so stretchy. They look so comfy. And I also just ordered like a black version that's like I heard was similar to this from Abercrombie. So when that order comes in, I'll make sure to update you and let you know how those work. But I'm really excited for those. And now these two things are what I did not order. These are navy boy shorts. It's just so random. Like, was this an accident? Okay, cute. I will definitely be wearing these because they look very comfy. And I don't have anything in their navy color, so that's super cute. I have the boy shorts. And then this is the cropped t-shirt. I've also always wanted to try one of their cropped shirts, but they're like super cropped. Like, they go right under your boobs. So, also in navy and size small, I believe. Yeah, I'm very confused about why this was sent, but I'm very happy about it and I'm not complaining. <laughs> now I have a couple things from Target that I think if you watched my last vlog, you would maybe know what this is because I talked about ordering it. This is my son. He sleeps through everything except being put down. I'm so excited about these. So I fell in love with these spring mugs that Target has. They come in four different colors, so I got one of each and they're perfect for spring. Look at this. They're like giant mugs, first of all. I don't know how many ounces they are, but they're very big and spacious and they have little flower, little ceramic detail on it so there's a teal one a beautiful purple one i'm so excited for these I hang them on my mug tree in my kitchen super cute little orange one these are perfect for spring and summer and then the last one oh it's broken wow well the last one is this yellow color but i'm gonna have to take a picture of that and then submit like a return but hopefully they can send me a replacement that's so sad i'm so excited about these but at least i have the other three but yeah those are super cute and i'm very excited to use them i'll link them below they're like ten dollars from target ten dollars each but worth it because they're super big mugs so. are you ever gonna let me put you down good morning just took a little family nap I need to use a diaper. <laughs> My friends are coming over soon. They're gonna bring 
kava which i'm so excited about and so i'm gonna pump on one boob and feed him on the other right now so that i can have milk to put in a bottle to feed him while they're here typically when people are here i'll just take him upstairs and feed him um while they just wait down here but that's usually when keiko is here and can entertain them and now i feel bad just leaving them here when keiko is not here to talk to them i'm just gonna make sure that i have a pumped bottle ready and i'm gonna feed him on the other boob right now so baby okay it's been a little bit hectic I was feeding him and he like wasn't super hungry so he kept falling asleep and then he started leaking out of his diaper and got pee everywhere huh so we had to clean that up and it was all over me and all over the pillow and we had to change you and change your diaper like mom why are you exposing me and yeah so we had to get that all cleaned up and I just switched boobs for pumping so now I'm pumping on my left and they're on their way so they'll be here in like 15 minutes probably the little man is just sitting here staring at me you just have the most perfect face ever <laughs> oh sleepy oh you're exploding another poop another one oh my goodness you're just a pooping machine you're a pooping machine he loves staring at this camera because it's just a huge black thing in his face you just love to poop okay guys hello it is much later. It's actually 8.25. Last time I talked to you was before my friends came over. And then once they came, I literally just forgot I was vlogging. So that's cool. Also, we were just catching up because I literally haven't seen them since like August. I think the last time they were here. They held Zeke for a little bit. And we just talked and they brought me kava. So that was super nice of them. Now we're getting ready for bed, obviously. I'm gonna put Zeke to sleep first and then I'm gonna go do my self-care and stuff like that. I put my PJs back on because they're just so comfy. I realized they're perfect for breastfeeding because they're buttoned down and normally I like don't wear anything to bed besides my like nursing bra because it's just convenient. But this is just as convenient because all I have to do is unbutton a couple buttons and then we're good. So we got that settled. Yeah, I'm gonna finish feeding him. Try to put him to sleep. He's like overtired, I think. Super fussy. So hopefully he sleeps well tonight. Okay, Koa comes home tomorrow morning, so I'm so excited about that. And yeah, I'll update you guys after. Okay, I successfully put Zeke down. And he actually stayed asleep and this never happens guys so this is this is good we're doing good things here <laughs> i'm gonna get ready for bed i need to wash my hair so bad so tomorrow when keiko gets home i'm taking the best shower of my life and i am so excited for it but i'm gonna wash my face brush my teeth use my new mouthwash and then i actually might edit a video because it's actually pretty early usually zeke goes down by like 10 but it's only nine o'clock so we're making better time and also he didn't get like a full feeding in that, like he normally does before bed so i feel like he's gonna wake up soon and be pretty hungry so if i'm awake already i feel like it's easier than going to sleep and having to wake up when he wakes up maybe that's just my thought process i don't know but i'm gonna wash my face and get ready for bed I'm gonna try the mouthwash hack where you mouthwash before brushing your teeth. Bottoms up. Okay, the only skincare I do besides washing my face is moisturizer at night. So this is the youth to the people one. I kind of want to try the Drunk Elephant moisturizer next, but also I hear that it breaks people out and this one's working just fine for me, so why would I switch it up if I don't need to? So I probably won't switch it, but we'll see. Contacts are out, glasses are on. I literally bought these things, the wristlet things that you use to wash your face and I forgot to use them, so that's cool. Okay, I'm gonna change my pad. Do my postpartum stuff. Okay guys, I'm gonna end this vlog here because I'm gonna start editing this video now and my night's also over, so no point in continuing the vlog. But I love you all so much. Make sure you subscribe and stay tuned for future videos. Yeah, let me know what kind of content you wanna see. I know my channel is changing drastically right now with the new baby. So let me know if you wanna see all the baby content or what type of content you don't wanna see that's baby related. Just let me know the whole thing. So I love you all so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.